Bats first began to live alongside humans about 10,000 years ago. Now the first phase of the history of the domestic cat, the first 5,000 years, we know very little about. But what we think was going on was that cats were coming in and preying on the mice, which had recently begun to be a real problem uh, in food stores in those very early towns and villages in Western Asia and possibly North Africa. At that point, cats would have been more or less wild animals, but they would have had to have become increasingly domestic because people would have started to encourage them to uh, live alongside them and prey on the mice all the time rather than coming in from the wild every night. So gradually cats must have become more accustomed to people but we don't think that any of those cats, we've no evidence that any of those cats were pet cats, we don't think they would have purred on anybody's lap. We have rather little evidence for what cats were like during that first 5,000 years except for one good piece of evidence which comes from Cyprus. The significance of Cyprus is that it's too far from the mainland for cats to have got there on their own. They must have been brought there by ship, by people. A piece of evidence that we have is somebody who was buried with a cat. Now we don't know what the relationship between that person and that cat was, but it does tell us that cats were being used as pest controllers and deliberately transported around as long ago as seven and a half thousand years ago.